Oh gosh, I think I have something in my eye. <laughs> oh my that's eyes. A, that's a great way to start off a video. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> hey everyone, it's Kristen with Coupon Friendly. I have my daughter here. Hayden. Hayden. Yes. Team fandom. Team. <laughs> On and Pinterest. I'm so, literally only on Pinterest, nothing else. So what's your Pinterest handle? What? What's your Pinterest name? Team Fandom. Team Fandom? Yeah. On Pinterest? Yeah. So if people look up Team Fandom, they will find you. Yes, they will. I am literally the only Team Fandom. But there is someone who has like their unique username as Team Fandom, but I'm the only one who has the actual name Team Fandom, and... My little username is um, Unite All Fandoms. That's, yeah. So before we get to it, I'd like to thank Degusta Box for sending me their April subscription box. You get around uh, 10 to 15 uh, new out on the market items for only $19.99. And it's about 30 plus dollars worth of stuff, food, so you get those creative juices flowing. So thank you so much for sending me that box. Yeah, all, all most of the stuff that they have in there is very tasty. It is super good. I mean, other things that I just haven't tried, but yeah, that's why I say most. So my daughter and I have been talking about um, wanting to uh, try new foods from different countries. And thankfully in our Degusta box, we got Candy from Spain and Feeny. Feeny. It's Feeny. fun. It's Feeny. That is their tagline. Uh, but anyways, so we're gonna try them out it's and we're gonna fun. see. It's Feeny. <laughs> we're gonna see if we like them. Okay. So this candy looks so appetizing. Mm. If you like sweet, sour, tart. This is the stuff to get. Okay, so first off, we're gonna start with the Feeny Fizzy Tornadoes. Check they kind of look like straws, but I'm pretty sure. That... Oh yeah, yeah, on the box. A berry oh, blend know. with a bit of fizz. Yeah, they look like they look like they're supposed to be straws or something. Yeah, like straws. probably why they're called tornadoes. They don't really have a middle. It's kind of like okay, you, you can suck out the inside. So. <laughs> So, um, as I'm opening this, I just wanted to tell you guys that, so this is, is a product to Spain, but they just recently, um, brought some of these products to the United States. And according to their website, um, these products, uh, were designed by American teens. So, oh, we're going to see if these are good. Well, they're kind of messy. Yeah. But that's kind of what you expect with tornadoes. Sugar surround, sugar surrounding the tar out of this thing. But it's hollow in the middle. Different colors. Yeah. Sometimes sugar will go in there and like kind of you kind of just suck it Very out. Very sour. Um, like mm -hmm. I'd say it's a mild sour. It's not like super sour. It's not like sour, like, like you make that sour face whenever you suck on a lemon. Yeah. It's not like that. Mm. Well, Sweet that and is, sour, kind of. That is good. I actually just ate all mine. <laughs> <laughs> it does leave a little yeah. mess on your hands, but what do you expect from candy? <laughs> you expect to get a little sticky. Especially, like, with the name Tornadoes. Tornadoes mm -hmm. are messy. Very. Soft and chewy candy. Soft and chewy, yeah. Those are good. Definitely what? Definitely were. Next is Shock Tongues. Candy Sour Belts. Six amazing flavors. It's amazing flavors. Now it seems as though these are, these kind oh, of look, look like. It's got like a bunch of flavors. Oh, I call the watermelon, which is uh, pink. Watermelon, green apple, grape, cherry, lemon, and blue raspberry. It'd be weird if blue raspberry was actually, like, purple or something instead of blue. Yeah. That'd be super weird. <laughs> One of the ingredients is the, in this is corn syrup, and so my husband cannot have any. My dad cannot have any. He cannot touch it. 
Okay. Uh, I'm pretty so sure this can... this one. I'm pretty sure that this one would be the watermelon. The watermelon. Because okay, there's like a pink, pinker one, pinker one. Uh, but that would most likely be just cherry. Okay, I'm gonna try the cherry. Okay. One, two, three. I feel like this is more messy. <laughs> yeah, it is. Kind of reminds me of gum. Yeah, it looks like a strip of the bubble gum. Yeah. Okay. A little bit more sour. Yeah. And, um, like you have to chew it a little bit. Kind of have to rip it apart. Like meat. But it's more su sour. I was about to say sweet, but it's not really that. Mm -hmm. Actually, is he? I don't think it was. They definitely were correct. We'll never said sour. Um, shock tongues. Yeah, sour belts. Ah, uh, burn my tongue. You know how you get whenever you like eat sour stuff for an extended period of time, and then like. Your tongue goes numb or... Yeah. That's what happens with most, like, super sour candies. Like, like, um, uh, like if they decided that they were going to make, like, a super sour, uh, bigger, like, warheads. Mm hmm If you ate that for an extended period of time, your tongue would go numb, most likely. Yeah, the, uh, the... The sour crystals are they're they're just messy. Yeah, they get that, everywhere. Yeah, they do get everywhere. <laughs> so I am excited to try something that doesn't have <laughs> that sour stuff on it. And these are what's called mini collisions. Mini collisions. Uh, the boldest ever sweet uh, mix of sweet and sour licorice. And so this is licorice from Spain. Do you want to try? They've oh, got I'll different kinds of, yeah. kind of flavors. Look, Look. <laughs> it kind of looks like a bunch of bricks, but it's also kind kind of like sticky. Do they have different kinds of flavor on them too? No, I don't think they do. Okay, ready, ready set, set, go. Mm. Mm. You okay? Okay. So. Seems like this, it's kind of sweet in the middle and a little sour around the middle. And it's, um, it's a very different taste than what I'm used to with licorice. Yeah. I would say 10 on all of these. Mm. It kind of, like, whenever you first take a bite of these things... Pretty sure they all have like different shapes, colors, and sizes. Like literally just comes with I like, can't put my my finger on the the flavor. It almost tastes like a vanilla. Like a vanilla cream in the middle. Yeah, I'm pretty sure and then like they have all different kinds of things. A little sour around Oh yeah, that's the one that I got. Mm hmm Maybe they're not all different. Maybe like I'm gonna I'm gonna try the same one that you did. Kind of. Okay. This one that I that oh, I did. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I know what you mean. It tastes a little different, doesn't it? Yeah. This one has like a lemon flavor to it on the inside. That's weird. And on the outside <laughs> is the and like a bit of sour. Yeah. You're not kidding. Whenever they see, they say the boldest ever. Yeah. It really is. It's definitely a different taste. So if you like like it flavor like a, mixes. Like, a cool, like a like a cream. Um flavored uh, cream in the middle. That that's definitely for you. <laughs> it's definitely for you. Um weird flavor mixes. Um Oh crap. <laughs> <laughs> you just got all of the the sour crystals just that is annoying <laughs> but nevertheless Hayden if you had to choose one definitely the sour belts 
<laughs> sour belts. <laughs> Didn't even finish your question, but I can definitely tell. Yep. I would totally take the sour belts. I honestly think that they're the best. I don't know. It's it's definitely yeah, definitely one of these two. But um, I I like the sour belts mostly because I mean, like you get that you get that kind of sour taste and. I, I like I like sour candies more than I do like sweet because sweet always kind of leaves a, a weird taste in my mouth. But sour never does. It just kind of leaves after a couple minutes. Yeah. All right. Well, um, be sure to check out um, their website. Check out the products that they have. Um, they are now distributing. Did I say that right? Dis distributing. Distributing. Di they have a distribution, distribution, dis, am I saying it right? Yes, you are saying There's it right. There's a distribution center here in the U.S. It just recently opened and opened for business and um, like I said on their website, this was created, um, designed by American teens and so they looked to us, not to me. Well, not to me, because I'm to me. I'm old. Kind of. Well, not really me specifically. So in between us. <laughs> in between us, yeah. <laughs> but they look to American teens to design this candy, and um, two I out of three ain't bad. I'm cool with it. So be sure to check out their website, and don't forget to check out my website at. Sorry. <laughs> Couponfriendly.com. Couponfriendly.com. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Also, be sure to thumbs. check out me thumbs uh, up. On, on Pinterest. I got my own board called My Posts, so you can check out that. And what's your what's your name on there? Team Fandom. Okay. How do you There's spell no that? Capital T. E A M. No space, capital F, A, N, D, O, M. Awesome. Okay. Subscribe to the channel. Give us a thumbs up. Which candy would you like to try? Are you a sweet or are you a sour? Like our souls. Mm. Let us know in the comments. And we'll see you guys next time. Very messy. Yes, super messy.